I've met quite a few patients now, family members who've been affected by TB. In Gulf Province, we know the rates are extraordinary. It's one of the worst places in PNG to actually get TB. We, we've seen so many people who just tell us about long trips by road, even walking five days, and dinghy trips of 10 hours to get to a, a local health centre. And they're, they're so keen to get treatment that they're just not able to do it. We're, you know, we're adapting our model in MSF to get to these patients. The other thing that really strikes me is the, the sense of stigma and exclusion that we're still seeing even in these communities. And we just talked to a young girl who who was telling us, you know, her plate and her cutlery was washed separately to the rest of the family. And her mum and dad were quite accepting, but the rest of the family found it difficult to live with her as they were normally up to that point when they knew that she had TB. Um, so these are the these are the things we're trying to get over and the challenges we're trying to approach. It's really a testament to how hard this project is that we've got continuing patients coming in as we try to reach them in their own communities. Um, it's a really amazing project. You know, TB is hard anyway, but this is TB in one of the hardest contexts I think MSF works.